Vince, thanks for showing us one, two, three, yes, four Marion today. No great block. I don't know if I've ever actually been on this block. It's great. That's what's nice about it. It's a one way street, no traffic down here. Unless you're coming to a house on the street, you don't go down the street at all. Okay. It's no traffic, None. no one just walking yeah. through. A lot of cool homes on the block as well. Yeah. And this one is certainly unique. Tell me more about this. Yeah. So it's also one thing I really like about it is it's one, two, three, four. Marion. Yeah. I just like the address. I'm kind of obsessed with one, two, three, fours. Um, you're also just very short walk over to Division Street, but you're not on Division, which is going to get a little loud, but you're, you're near it. Um, take a look at the brick facade on this house. That is old Chicago brick. For, uh, know that construction, put that together. This is Looks great. Uh, a huge construction company in Chicago, Novak. You've seen there off of the expressway. They do the Christmas lights every yeah. year. Uh, this is his youngest, or his old, yeah, his youngest daughter's house. Okay. This is for her. Uh, this is old Chicago brick that he had been saving for special occasions, like his daughter's house. And it has kind of a, um, a firehouse look. That's what I thought this was. Yes. So it was built to look like that, but this yes. wasn't a firehouse. It was just time. built in 2016. It so looks like it's been here forever. It looks like it's been here forever. Yeah. Um, if you take a peek on the side of the house, maybe go over there, this side too. Uh -huh. Look at the side. He did like this corrugated steel on yeah, the side. That looks really sharp. Efficient. That corrugated steel, it's a much more modern look. Yeah. Different. And it's going to, for maintenance wise, oh, it's going to hold up forever. Easiest, That's easier than anything easiest, else. Yeah. yeah. Um, and you know, getting this curb cut for this garage is great too, because you can see you can just park your, your guests can just park right on this real nice. driveway too. Uh, and then it's attached. You walk right into the house. Now, one of the most impressive parts, I mean, the home is beautiful. But this shot. Yes. That's why is, we're talking. That's what grabbed my this eye. This is the money shot right here. For yeah. Sure. Yeah, it's a 31 foot wide lot. You really feel it in this room. What's the depth? Uh, 108. 108. You 108. don't even feel it. I mean, it, it feels, feels like it's full well size and you definitely feel the width. And we'll get to, we'll see the backyard in a minute, but it's no, there's no alley there. I'll also like to point out this, you look at the stairs, they have a young a young child. So they took the, um, Smart. they put wood in here and they put wood in between the stairs, but you can take that out and you'd be able to see through the stairs, which is a really cool look when it, you come into the house. And we were so. talking about it a little bit earlier. I love these ridges that are right on here. Yeah. You, when you feel it as you walk in, it it's just great. makes you feel a little more stable on stairs. <laughs> it is, it's, it's nice. You don't have to put runners on there. And yeah, you know. and you know where you are on the step. That's what I noticed. Yeah. Like, okay, my heel's here, I know where it is. Yeah, <laughs> it's safe. Um, so they have this kind of, uh, this hidden closet here for their you know, for their jackets and stuff. And it's I love when people do this with the pivot size. hinges. I know. That was an automatic light, so that turned on yes, with motion. I love that. Powder rooms tucked away, which is nice. It's not like, um, sometimes you have those powder rooms, you open the door and it's like- It's super strange. Red. Hey, You're it like, just oh, came out of the bathroom. You, yeah, right? Like, were you listening? Guess what oh, I was no. doing. Yeah, so uh, it's nice to have that tucked away in private. Super wide plank pine floors and you can feel the grooves in them mm -hmm. and they just, they get like a, a patina to them that just makes it feel old again. But again, five years old. Was but there like, any thought process to this when they were explaining it to you or told you why they made these choices? You know, they used uh, Lederbeck and Graham, which is a really, fancy architectural firm. Mm -hmm. um, Graham actually did this house himself. So there's a lot of thought that went into this house. Okay. A lot of heads, a <laughs> yeah, lot of minds working together. We talked about the Chicago brick before. Uh, over here, more Chicago brick and this two-story fireplace wall. So this ties right into the yeah, whole thing. It's great. It's, it's just a new plus old world. Uh, the exposed uh, timber on the ceiling you can see up there. Chandelier is a great touch. Yes. I, lo I love the plants they have as well. The biggest plant. Oh, look how big that fiddle thing yeah. is in that corner. <laughs> it's insane. Um, they chose not to do window coverings because they just felt they wanted everything to see, they wanted to see everything all the time. So, I totally understand that. I don't have any yeah. window treatments in my place. And it's one of the first questions <laughs> people ask when they come in. I'm like, hey, if you want to look, yeah. that's on you. That's, <laughs> that's not on, on me. <laughs> Sometimes I don't wear pants. That's on you. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not the weird one. You're the weird one. <laughs> so the backyard also, what is nice is that it's just right off your main oh, This floor. is great. I didn't notice this while you were inside. I mean, yeah, these this is here. Chicago history right beneath our feet. Yeah, everywhere you go. Because there's no alley here. Yeah. It's very private. There's a big tree. It it's so quiet. It doesn't sound like you're in the city right now. You no, can hear the birds quiet. chirping. You don't hear any you auxiliary can, noise. Street, you can throw a rock and hit it. Yeah. And it's really quiet. Um, and I, I like looking back at here because it's a totally different house. Yeah. Like, Wow, it's this really feels modern now. Like the front of the house. It's beautiful. They got a ball stuck there. Yeah, the ball, the ball stuck <laughs> on the left side. Yeah, the siding's immaculate. I really like the it's, color that they chose. Oh, that green cool. is very I solid. Know. Just so it's low maintenance or, or no maintenance, really. So great kitchen. I like the color on the cabinets. Yep. 
No uppers over here, which is really nice. They kept it all there, yeah, but it feels cool. open. Actually, I got like a pantry over here, essentially. Everything's kind of open, but it's plenty of storage. Looks real sharp. I love this table. It's, I'm sure they're taking this with them, but metal really fits the place. Yes. He, uh, her, um, her father who built this, he has a famous blue sculpture that's like that, that is now on Lakeshore, on the Lakeshore Drive on the actual lake. You can see Oh, nice. It. Oh, that? Yeah. That's I know what father. you're talking about. Yeah, her father, wow. that's her father donated that to the city. That's so cool. Um, now we're up in the second floor and the master. This yeah. is nice. See this catwalk here. Oh, so you're open. Nice. You can come out, greet yeah. your guests, say hi. You can smell bacon. <laughs> I mean, this is the best. Oh, that'll get you out of that. will get me out of that. Um, so, the, you know, these pocket doors here, which are nice. Um, the, one of the world's biggest lampshades you'll ever yes. see in your life. I mean, you can live in that. <laughs> it's pretty big. Storage or you know the closet they had kind of a his and hers and it's probably enough for most people. I mean I think if you're like a really big clothing prob person maybe you need more than this, but that's on you. I think this most, is a lot. most people can get the other clothes in there. I love how it's built in, it ties in, and they're gonna have no mess here if you don't want yeah. it. You can always close this, but it's easy to access. So in here, the one with a you know kind of an old world look with all this marble. Yeah. Um what I like is and it's the gonna steel, it, yeah, sharp. steel. I think it's got this restoration hardware actually, but it looks great. Uh, it's just going to, it's going to age well. Yeah. You I know, mean, it's going to have some patina to it. It feels very Soho House in here, I think. I agree with that. And then here, it's actually one of these lights. There we go. I know it's a little dark. Um, you know, giant shower with steam bath and all the body sprays and all that stuff. And some nipples over here. <laughs> don't, don't miss the nipples. Even the accessories, you know, this, oh, you're not wow. going to find this at Home Depot. Yeah. This is special. This is nice. <laughs> yeah, they do not Looks like Lucite or Depot. something similar. Yeah. All right. We'll go back here. It's separated from the master. We're going to, this is your laundry area here. Okay. Open, accessible, because yeah. the kids can just oh, throw their laundry yeah, directly so in like, when they're done. This is the kids area now. Yeah. <laughs> and we're back here and then you have two good sized rooms. Let me actually open the curtain, the shades here because okay. they have a young in. Now they don't have the other things. They have the blackout, they have blackout shades all the way down. Let's just keep them down. Okay. It's okay. Um, but it's, you know, it's a good size. It's hard to tell with a nursery in here, but there's plenty of room for a king bed if you wanted. And which, which way are we facing here? This is facing south. Facing south. Okay. So you're going to get great light from here and that's why they have it yeah, blinded up. that's why they have it blacked out. <laughs> and then here you'll see, you know, you get, you get good sun. And you know, good. Wow, size even the windows window. look original. Yes. But, it, but in a good way. I mean, they're keeping the character of the theme all the way through. Yeah, this this is over the garage. You can see because this is very thick, obviously. Mm -hmm. Where over here it's a little less space because it's the steel and the spray foam insulation. Would you want to see the basement too? Yeah. Okay, let's go see the basement. Yeah, let's do it. This, this piece of furniture. And then this bath, real quick. Okay. Very straightforward. Same palette as the other bath. Oh yeah. Like that tub is like real wide too. Yeah, it's nice. It's it's nice. It's kind of a classic look. I don't think that look is going out of style anytime soon. I agree with you. You know, that's kind of the beautiful thing about and you know I, I would call this modern, and yes. modern to me is always timeless. It's always going to hold. Yep. Not just uh, not not that super sleek modern, which can date relatively quickly. Yes. Even the stools they chose are a great choice. <clears throat> Add some more color Dad to the room. Has a warehouse full of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> he has, he collects all kinds of stuff. He goes like flea markets and stuff. Love this tile. Yeah, it's looks great. really good. So this is, you know, now we're in the basement and what's interesting they did here in, in commercial projects, you'll see steel shoring where they have that big metal you know, steel wall. They pound it into the ground and they use it for reinforcement. They do that here in this house, which is, you just don't see that. No, in, you're not um, going to find that for a residential project. Unless you're doing a huge basement. And this is pretty, it's really, it's not a huge really nice. basement, but it is a uh, high ceiling. Yeah. Um, and they did uh, luxury vinyl flooring down here, which is very popular now for the basement flooring. Um, this is a, this is a really cool bath. I mean, if you take a look at that shower, it has those glazed. Oh yeah. Bone, and, and the herringbone on in, it. No glass, nice and easy. And they have a TV upstairs, but this is kind of like your, your cozy. TV room down here. Uh, they have obviously they have a surround sound, and then there's also a wine room here. Nice. They never really built the wine room out, but you could do that. They just didn't think they, you know, they didn't need a refrigerator or a wine room. Yeah. <laughs> you can, and then beyond that, it's more storage. And then these are mechanicals. Okay. Um, 
and then so that it's it's three zones. It's one furnace and air conditioning compressor per floor. Okay. So it's really efficient. And if you're not going to be somewhere, you're not going to be in the basement for a while, keep it. And of course, the Peloton room. Every house has to have a Peloton. So it's, just, it's a federal law now. <laughs> this is like staging furniture now, <laughs> It's like right? staging, yes. <laughs> this, you live or no, that's a staging Peloton. <laughs> uh, and then this is like your, your in-law suite or something. But um, it's nice. They have a nice bathroom down here. And if, if you do have in-laws, they have their own TV room and their own wine room. So they can stay drunk and happy. That's nice. They can be down here and that's all they need. Yes. Keep them away from you. <laughs> now, if you have any questions, I think I probably said everything, but... Um, I think that was really straightforward. Yeah. You answered a ton of the questions. Thank you so much for your time. This is a beautiful Thanks, listing. Yeah, Glad we're, we're doing another deal right now. And yes, I saw we this are. Pop it's going up. great. You're so good. Yes. We're, clo <laughs> we're closing on theirs today. Oh, good. On their, on their, wow. on their cell. Yeah, your buyers, tell them thank you for really hustling and yeah. doing a great job. You too. I met the people at yeah. the end of the block yesterday. Oh, you did that you? own oh, it, the new Tom, one. and the, yeah, the one that the just one that, went the on, one that's still, the pink block. Yes, they, did you want the broker open? Yeah. Oh, I heard it was good. Yeah. Oh man, I should be gone. <laughs> Next time. <laughs> thanks for doing this, Vince. Uh, thanks, Appreciate Sean. it. Take care. See ya. Oh, gotta get it with right. I got it. Okay, okay see ya. Thank you. Bye.